Hello again, Magwin WK. Starting a new playthrough, Dragon Force, for the Sega Saturn. Indeed, I should press the start button and go with a new game. This is a partially requested by Rocky Armis, but I've been wanting to do this for a long time. In particular, he requested Samurai. Our game with Samurai. That would be going to the Izumo Nation. Having played this before on an actual Sega Saturn, until mine was stolen, more on that. But yes, now that I have the computer powerful enough, I can actually record in decent quality. Maybe not perfectly. The Legend of Emperor Mikau. This will be a more of a casual, a casual, but informative narrative, and probably a little bit of my own quirky humor. So let's select him and be on the way to the loading screen. First Sega Saturn game I have ever recorded. So let's hope this works. Let's hope this beautiful ninja samurai behind Emperor Macau has good news for us. Shield. Hmm. An assassination plot against the Emperor's father. And yet this jerk, Kolark, one of the eight nations on the Isle of Legendra, is causing trouble. Probably involved in some dark stuff. So Honor Senbai must defend his home nation. Whoa, whoa there, young lady. That is not necessary. I don't know what to say about that. But here we are at the console, council, or the opening scene here. Lots of talk, and while well, the English translation, even the official one, is a little bit screwy. Nonetheless, our friends are here. Our best generals. I don't know whether to call this a real-time or turn-based strategic game, because it's kind of both. One player only. And here I am. In the planning phase, if you will. I can hand out awards if I had any. No items, grant audiences to speak with generals or my prisoners. Oh dear. I don't think I want to know Jackal. And they get three basic stats, strength, intelligence, and command. Strength being their personal ability of fighting. Intelligence, of course. 
domestic affairs and command how well they command their troops. General Mikkel himself is a fairly balanced general with decent command and good strength. Quite decent, I mean very good command. Stats can't go above 100 though. And they have various types of troop classes. More of them on the way. So let's finish this domestic fun and have Shion search our home country. Each turn, a general with intelligence above 70 can either search the province or fortify the castle. Oh dear. That is rotten. A failure nonetheless. Don't worry, we'll have more success as we get more powerful. A level 19 castle is not too bad. And of course, we can be done with it. Have a look at our overall map. And the various cities. And the kingdoms which they reside in. Some being independent, of course. But they will be conquered over time. So yes, it is truly December 23rd. I am playing this before Christmas. I hope you all have, a, have, have had a happy holiday. This won't appear until January. In year one, month one, week one. Yes, week to week is a turn. So let's be done with this. It actually gets to a little action here. On the maps phase, While time runs out, us the purple lavender map flag, we should conquer more countries. To the north is Fandaria, led by guess who? Goldar. He's very tough though, and he has some very good generals as well. So I'm going to leave him alone for the moment, because he cannot, because of his large land. And we have a neutral guy separating us. Kayon. So instead we will proceed southeast, and occasionally freelance generals will roam the land. Maybe to capture castles. Maybe just, just sit around and have fun. So for right now. I'm going to send out my... Three strongest, except Shion. Actually, I think I'll take her with her. Me. Leave Mistal to defend the castle. And now Mistol is the governor of that castle. And she can deliver... Keep that castle in our command. As we go capture another castle. Don't want to expand too fast, but quickly is better. To the south of Izumo, our home nation, is the land of Bozak. Led by... Emperor Gongos, a beast man type. Not very smart guy now, is he? But he's strong and powerful in duels. So we want to avoid duels. Or overdoing duels, I should say.
and we're going to expand one more castle here and leave Jackal to defend this castle because there is no other way to it. And our next target, being at the crossroads, has been taken over by the free general of Mia and her friend Slate. We might actually get into a battle. And the computer controlled nations will attack each other. We can eat each other. So you can take advantage of it. But for right now, I'm going to pause the game and go to the next video. Because some of these battles can take a little while. And after a lengthy introduction, not including the introduction movies, of course, I'm sure you want to see a fresh video with a fresh battle.